afternoon and welcome to number 24 Shrewsbury Way, situated ideally in Saltney, just under two miles from the city centre, but close to an array of shops. You've got an Asda, Morrison Supermarket, really popular with first time buyers and investors this location. Now number 24 has had an awful lot of work done to it in recent years and it would make a great first time home in my opinion. It's got the open plan contemporary accommodation, You've got a brand new kitchen, which I'll show you as soon as I walk in, but also we've got a single detached garage there, which has got power, so it can be used more as a utility space. You could also, I think you've got, you've got potential there to convert that into somewhere to do some home working as well. There's off-road parking for at least one car in front of the garage, and I'm stood in a nice walled garden, and we're situated on the end, so there's no neighbour to the right-hand side, so it's a good plot, and as you can see, we're in the full sunshine now, but the back garden faces southwesterly, so it gets sun all afternoon and into the early evening. So I'll show you around the property and point out the work that's been done. So it's UPVC double glazed all the, all the way through. These properties have got sort of the, the faux Georgian design. Come into an entrance porch, we've got this new grey laminate flooring which has been fitted to the whole of the ground floor and the owner initially when he bought the property there was a door and a wall here which led you into the kitchen so he's opened the living room straight into the kitchen bringing all that natural light from the back of the property. So a really good space lounge. There should be a couch here, but it's on order. Uh, Built-in blinds here, which actually very contemporary. They let a bit of light in, but also give you the privacy if you want it, but you can still see the green of the front garden underneath. And then into the kitchen. What I really like is these worked surfaces. I've seen a lot of them at the moment. It's like a compressed composite um, work surface. It just gives you a more stylish edge, more sharp lines with the dark contemporary units. And on the other side here, We've got a built-in breakfast bar, so there's room for at least two people to sit. So you've got your dining space, but I also think there's room enough in the living room to have a dining table as well as a couch. Here in the kitchen, we've got an integrated Indesit dishwasher there. You've got your plumbing for washing machine. Combination boiler here, which is a glow worm, which is less than a year old. Now the owner was telling me to have the heating on over the last 66 months even, um, at a, a temperature of 16 degrees, and his gas bill is coming in at 55 pounds per month, which is extremely low. You've got halogen ceramic hob there, electric oven, again, all indesits are good stuff, and then space here for a fridge freezer, extractor over. So you've got two big windows here, just letting the light come in, and then we've got a UPVC double H door, which takes us into the back garden. So the back garden is extremely private. You've got quite a little used railway line behind it. It's the Chester to Wrexham line. So you get a train about every hour and they're very, very quick and quiet. I live not far away, so I can, att I can attest for that. So the garden at the moment, we're coming up to five o'clock and you can see the sun is still coming in onto your patio. So you get home from work and you're gonna get some sunshine when it comes out. There's a further patio or space here to the side with timber gated access to the front of the property, room for your bins to be hidden so you're not looking at them from your kitchen window. This goes into your garage, which has been re-roofed, it's electrified. So like I say, you could have in there a little bit of utility space, it's got space for a tumble dryer. So again, you could have a bit of a utility corner in there and then keep all your garden equipment to the front. So quite a lot of space that you wouldn't expect, an awful amount of privacy. So that's the back garden, lovely sunny spot. But from here, we can literally walk onto the high street in less than two minutes, and we can be at Asda in less than five minutes, and that's just a gentle stroll. There's a regular bus service which comes in from North Wales that comes along the main high street. So you've got buses every, roughly every 15 to 20 minutes if you rely on public transport as well. So that's the downstairs. I'll show you the upstairs now. Again, really nice, thick pile carpet, takes you to the first floor. It's all white, so very neutral. Nothing not to like, but you can come in and put your own stamp in on the property. And then to the first floor, we've got two good sized bedrooms. Nice window here, again, subtly facing, bringing lots of light onto the landing. And then the master bedroom, it's a good sized double. It's quite deceptive actually, because it sort of comes around behind the door. And then you've got two really decent built-in storage cupboards which go over the stairs. So we've got this one here, which is a half cupboard. This one here, which I've been given permission to open, which is a bit of a, a walk-in wardrobe. Nice matte black hanging rail here, built-in shelving above. And then you've got a bit of floor space for your shoes or what have you. So again, good storage, which you can just close the door on. Again, new carpet, light gray, nice and thick. And then the second bedroom, again, could be, I think, a small double, currently used like everyone at the moment as a home office, but it's quite a comfortable home office. You could actually get a single bed 
and still keep the desk in as well, in my opinion. And I'll just show you out so you can see what the outlook is. You've got obviously some really mature and established shrubbery, which gives you lots of privacy. And in the distance is the railway line. But like I say, I sold this house to the present owner in a very different condition a couple of years ago. And there were several people who wanted to buy it. So I don't think that was a particular issue. And then last but not least, there should be a bifold door, which is being put on tonight. So imagine I've just opened the bifold door. It's a nice, it's a nice white one into the walk-in shower room. Again, I really love this gray gloss finished under storage cupboard with matching display counter, really contemporary, but really clean. Nice white suite with a big double walk-in shower cubicle, nice and roomy. You're not gonna bang your elbows in there with a Triton electric shower. Uh, extensively tiled, but when it isn't tiled, I like this nice gray paint, very in, which matches with, I think it's graphite colored heated towel rail. So really lovely first time home potentially. If you were to walk in and basically not have to do any work, this is the property for you. We're in the Chester side of, of Saltney as well, which tends to be sometimes a, a bit more popular. Um, so I think this property is gonna go particularly well. So give me a call if you wanna find out more about particularly the area, because I hopefully know the area quite well. Or if you want to book a viewing, we'll be very happy to show you around. So our number at Current Homes is 01244 313 900. Thanks for watching.